Today we're going to do flower printing. This is a super fun and easy art activity that allows you to print and paint with flowers and other natural materials. Let's gather our materials. The materials we'll need for flower printing include flowers, and this could be all one kind of flower, for example from a bouquet or it can be an assortment of flowers that you pick from your garden. And you can also do this with leaves. You will also need sturdy paper or cardstock and some tempera paint in shallow dishes. Let's set up for success. To prepare for the best possible experience with flower printing, you'll want to protect your work surface with a waterproof tablecloth or an art mat Let's create. To begin, dip the flower head in the shallow dish of paint and then press it to the paper. You can repeat this with other colors or other flowers as much as you like to create abstract art, to create images, to create the effect of a flower bouquet or a flower garden. You can experiment with the different effects of less or more paint. You can experiment with making a clean print of a flower or with painting with the flower head using it as a paintbrush. There are lots of different ways you can explore this art activity. If you like, once your artwork is finished, you can add details with a pen or pencil for example, you could add the vase to a flower bouquet that is created by flower printing. You can turn your flower prints into a garden by drawing on the stems and leaves and the rest of the garden. You can turn your flower prints into just about anything with the addition of, of drawing. Basically, use the flower prints as a drawing prompt. I hope you enjoyed this art activity. It's time to create, it's time to create. It's time to experiment and make something great. Let's explore.